Hello everyone, it's me once again. So what we have here is a big box that has been delivered from uh, Japan. I actually bought it from a company called Hobby Japan. It was 74 pounds online, so I thought that's a really good deal. Uh, not knowing that there's going to be a parcel uh, cost and also the import tax as well. So 74 pounds for the actual uh, goods and the parcel was about 48 pounds and the import uh, VAT and clearance was £35.72. So it all came down as £157.75, which was £40.75 more than Amazon. So I actually had, could have got it earlier and cheaper than uh, on Amazon than actually straight ordering from Japan. So there's a big regret there, but anyhow, I got the goods for you so you can actually have a look. So this is the Faz. Uh, Vert car. So if you imagine, I'm a great fan of um, Gundam and especially Vert car. I'll show you some of the more series later on on my videos. But um, this is the double Zeta, and that's the old school Faz. So imagine that quality of grey coloured new version of this one. That's what we have here. So let's do the unboxing. So here it goes. Oh my god, look at this. Okay. Wow. So I thought there was going to be a lot of airbags, but it's not. It's quite a big package. Look at that. Whoa. It's quite heavy as well. Do you have enough? That is a big box. I'm quite impressed actually. Wow. No wonder why it costs so much. So you can actually have it here. The um, same version, a thinner version of um, Double Zeta in all arm armored as well. So let's actually go inside. That's very nice. So I think this is the leg joint, mostly. Um, what do we have here? Well, some of the central parts and I think some guns and the, also the crown. I like to call it the crown. So this is K2, some of the um, bits that Zeta has to have on top. I believe that's also the frontage central part. Um, where are the faces? I want to see the beautiful face. I don't see any beautiful face here. Or did I just miss it? That looks like the one of the most essential part here. Anyway, so it's pretty standard for a car version, but I can see a bit of gray tint on it around with the purplish tint as well, which you can't see from the, um, wow, that's a lot. Can you see that? This is for your own joy, because I love you guys. Start to get boring, doesn't it? I know, bear with me. That's a lot of stuff to be built. Okay. Anyway, so that's some of the other bits. I can see that's the part of the, the plane that turns into a gun, isn't it? Yeah. I'm literally opening up every single thing for you guys to have a look. So you can check the quality. Straight from Japan. Oh, that's going to be a tricky one. That wire bit. Straight from Japan. Some of the hands, which is good news. So moving all these fingers are really annoying. And that's something they have improved for the double Z for a car. So the same case for Faz as well. And lastly, got that. 
And let's look at the instructions, people. The beautiful instructions, rather small comparing to the size of the box. So all of these. So I've got to build all of these. Please pause and um, flick through it if you want. So imagine if someone gives you this or the puzzle, which one do you, do you want to go for? I'll rather go for this one. There's a great joy of building Gundam. I've been doing quite a lot of them actually lately. And these are just beautiful. Look at that. So excited. That's how it's going to look. That's the old version I have that I showed you from early on from this video. And that's all the decal that I have to put in as well. Wow, long way to go. Long way to go. <laughs> so probably this is going to be the biggest Gundam that I've ever built in my life so far. So it's going to take ages. I can see the quality and quantity of it. Um, after I apply the decal, then what I'm going to do is compare the quality against a Zeta, double Zeta Vercar and also the fans as well so um hope you guys stay in tune so thank you very much for watching this video this is lgp tech have a nice weekend all the best bye bye